Hi besties! Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in and clicking on this video. I really truly appreciate it. Today we're going to do a Timu haul, of course. What else would we do, right? <laughs> we love our Timu hauls, so that's why we are here. So I've actually had this stuff for a while. So what has happened is I bring down packages to this room where I do these videos and I sit them along the wall or I sit them down and I forget, you know, what comes first or what's come second or whatever. And uh, <laughs> I went through them today and I order, put them in order of how they're dated. And this bag is from January. January. Yeah. So it's been sitting down here a while. I just kept skipping over it to do other things. So... <laughs> I will say that I don't know if the items in this bag are going to be available or if they've been discontinued or who knows because it's been so long that it's really hard to say. So with that being said, let's just get right into this. Um, so yeah, they delivered this to my house on January 20th. Let's just start with this, shall we? Let's just start with this big popcorn bag. Does anybody... What's your, what's your guess on what this is? Anybody? Anybody? What do you think this is? <laughs> I'm going to tell you what this is, okay? It is a bag that your cats can crawl in. Okay, so as a cat parent, I'm sure you know that, that your cat likes to get into crinkly bags, right? So this was $6.98. This was actually the medium-sized one, um, and it looks pretty daggone big. So it was $6.98 when I bought it. Let's see what this looks like and I don't know if it's bigger like I don't know if this thing folds out I don't know it kind of looks like it does so this was $6.98 I can't wait to see how the cats react to this oh my gosh it's like giant it's huge holy moly look at that thing it's enormous I can't believe that so it's literally just like a paper bag your cats can get into that is so funny but the funny, like, look, there's, like, a little cat on the front of the bag. <laughs> it says, fresh and crisp popcorn. Giant-sized. I'm sorry, this is hilarious. I love it. But, yeah, the inside is literally just a paper bag for them to crawl in and out of. Delilah will absolutely love this because if I'm, like, upstairs and pricing items for Timu and I have my Timu bag there, she will run over and jump inside the bag. So she is going to love this popcorn, huge popcorn bag. This thing is big. I wonder how big the large one was if this was the medium. Like, this was the medium-sized one? Holy, holy moly. That's crazy. Yeah, she's going to love that. I can't, I can't wait to show her that. She's, she's going to be super uber duper excited because she loves bags. So, okay. Six, so that was $6.98. Okay. More florals. These were $2.59. Uh, I got it in the color pink. It looks like maybe a peony or a peony or however you want to say it. Or it could be, who knows? I don't know. I'm not, I'm, I'm not real sure. I think that's what it is, but let's check it out. All right, so you get one stem, it's two fifty nine. dollars Kermit's down here. Maybe I can introduce him if he settles down for a minute. These are gorgeous. Look at that flower right there. Like, wow. He's playing on in the bags. And then you get this other little stem right here, which is like closed, sort of. But how pretty is that? Like, wow. Like, those are, those are great. Hi everyone, this is Kermit. Kermit, look. I say hi to our family. Say hi to our YouTube family, Kermit. So everybody, this is Kermit. We've had him, oh, uh, what, a couple weeks now, Kermit? Huh? He's like, I want to play with that bag. He is a very fun, cute, special boy, huh? Yeah, yes you are. So just want to, he looks, <laughs> he looks mad. Are you mad at me? I'm sorry. You want down? Okay. All right. He wants down. He's not, he's, he's a little bit camera shy yet, but I wanted to introduce you guys. Okay. So here is this flower. I love these. I think they look amazing. If you want to kind of make it open up a little bit more, spray it with a little bit of water, hit it with your hair dryer and it'll open up or use a steamer. But wow. I mean, that is gorgeous. Look at that. Wow. I would, I would make my own wedding bouquet with that those kind of flowers. They're amazing. 
Okay. Next is this. And I, okay. I know I've had this bag a long time because I actually was going to give this to my mom for Mother's Day. But with that being said, her birthday is in June. So it's just this big, huge card. This was $3.49. Um, and I'll show you. Hopefully I can open it without ruining it. And hopefully it doesn't say Happy Mother's Day on it. So it comes with this little card that's just blank that you can write on. And then here's the card. And I don't know, but you open it up. I don't want to open it because I'm scared. But when you open it, it's like a big 3D bow of bouquet. 3D bouquet of flowers. Oh, wait. It says to open using both hands, pinch and ends of the ribbon together. What ribbon? Oh, I see, I'm afraid to do it, but it opens up like this. So it's kind of like 3D. I don't want to do it because if I open it, I don't know if I can close it and then get it back in here. So, but honestly, this is really, really pretty. Like how pretty is that? And you get this big, huge envelope with it. This big, huge, like craft colored envelope. But yeah, it's really pretty. It looks like flowers wrapped up in a thing but that this is the part you're right on and then they can have this for like their countertop or whatever but so yeah I thought that was really cute so for $3.49 I mean heck that's there's cards more expensive at Hallmark than that you know what I mean like you can get this really cool card for $3.49 so totally love that okay next is another one <laughs> okay I must have bought this one for probably Brian's mom so we will probably keep this one for her birthday. It's the same kind of idea. This one was $3.67, and it's lilacs. See, I was going to use these for Mother's Day, and you know what's funny is I looked for these. I'm like, where did I put those cards? I had this bag hidden, and I couldn't, yeah, it was like out of sight, out of mind, I guess. So, okay, $3.67 for this one. You get a little card to, like, write on, so you don't have to write on the big card. It comes with this big envelope. And then here's the actual card. And then you take this off of here. And like I hate to, like I said, I hate to kind of push it out and do it, but it'll open up. Oh no. Okay, it does go back. So it opens up like that. How pretty is that? How pretty. It's like a little 3D card. But yeah, you just smoosh it together and it goes back. So I'm going to put this back in here. And I will save this for Brian's mom's birthday. So you can write on this and write whatever sentiment you want. And you have the card and the envelope, which is really nice. It's, it's this really nice big envelope that opens up. And yeah, it was $3.67. But like I said, that's cheaper than like Hallmark cards. So yeah, those are great. Those are really pretty cards. Okay, I bought these stencils for, they were only $5.48, and you get nine of them. And they are like herb, they have like herb writings on them, and I thought they would be really pretty if I could find like pieces of wood that fit all of these and make like a, a whole set for like the kitchen or something. So there's one that's dill, you have one that's mint, you have sage, um, let's see here, oregano, uh, bay leaf. So yeah, they're just stencils you can use with your paints. Um, parsley. Rosemary. I love rosemary. Uh, cilantro. And last but not least, thyme. So yeah, they're just stencils. So if you're making any kind of... These would be so pretty in like a country kitchen or a farmhouse kitchen. Just get a piece of wood. Or something. Or, I mean, if you have a little cabinet, like, if you want to put these on your cabinets, oh my gosh, wouldn't that be adorable? Like, if you had, just put this in the middle of your cabinet. Okay, that might be, like, a whole vibe. I might do that, because there's probably enough here. I bet I could do these on every single cabinet in my, in my kitchen. Oh my gosh, that would be stinking adorable. So, yeah, because they're, like, the perfect size for, like, the middle of a cabinet, aren't they? I love those. So, yeah, for $5.48, you get nine stencils. Those are great. I love those. That's a good, that's a good deal there. Okay, these, this is just um, some pieces of ephemera for like junk journals or crafting. They were $1.59 and um, it says flower house color or the, the colors are flowers bloom under the moon. But I think they're just pieces of paper. Let me try and get them out of here. I don't even know how, it doesn't say how many are in here. But I love buying stuff like this on, on Timu because they're just so pretty. They have like really pretty 
I'm gonna let me tear this off so you can see these but this is what they look like like even around the edges here are like cut but how pretty are those they're like Paris kind of motif you get all different ones um they're, they're just pieces of paper that you can use really really pretty you get all kinds of different ones oh I love this one look how pretty that one is love that one but yeah they're just different pieces of paper really pretty oh I like this one too it's got like the grid with the flower down here really pretty yeah those are great but they're just pieces of paper to use for journaling or junk journaling or whatnot so yeah dollar 59 for those really pretty love those okay next I got these to you do like some eye makeup looks and I like to use these whenever I have a eyeshadow color that is maybe a little shimmery or glittery or I like to use my finger but you get a whole pack of these they are $1.99 for 50 so I thought well, that's kind of a steal you know but they're just these like sponge tip applicators you know you get 50 of them um, they're really good to use if you have like I said like a certain shade you really want to like get on your eye pretty heavy um, some shimmer shades some glitter shades they don't tend to stick with a brush when you put them on the brush so you have to sometimes use your finger or one of these so super handy for $1.99 Ooh, these are pretty. Pretty pair of earrings. These are in the color blue and white, it says. They were $1.99 when I bought them. <laughs> I don't know how much they are or if they're available now, but they're really pretty. If I can get them out of here. Oh, it's okay. It's in a bag within a bag within a bag. Of course, of course it is. But this is kind of what they look like. They're really shimmery. Wow, these are going to be great in the summer. Hold on. Let me try to figure out how to open this. There we go. Come on out of there, fashion jewelry. Ooh, they're like heavy. They've got some weight to them. This is what they look like. Ooh, the the clasps are gold. Or I'm sorry, not gold. They're silver. But look how fancy. Wow, those are fancy, aren't they? A lot of light. Catching a lot of light there. A whole lot of light. Really pretty. I know they had these in different colors. I probably bought them in different colors too, to be quite honest with you. But I like that they're silver right here. Really, really pretty. Wow. But they do have some weight to them. Very pretty. Very, very pretty. For $1.99, yeah. But I know they had different colors too, so. Okay, a set of nails, of course. Why we wouldn't even be a haul without a set of nails. These were $2.39. And they're kind of like a medium length. And they look... They've got some holographic look to them. See how they're like pink, but they're like holographic. You know, I hope you can see that. You can kind of really see it up at the top here. But yeah, those are really pretty. I think I bought these before. They look really pretty on too. So I put these on. I think these nails were my last haul. And uh, they're okay, but I got them in a, a large, which is barely fitting me. And I've already had like one of them fall off, so... Yeah, I don't know. I, I used the Candy Moyo glue from Dollar Tree, and I don't know. It just didn't want to stick on this time. So I, I'm not sure if it's the nails, the glue, or what. And I even did all the things I usually do to get the nails to, to stay. But Okay, I must have had these in mind for <laughs> um, Valentine's Day, but they're heart nails. These were $0.79. Cents. Wow, that's a steal. I love Timu nails. If I bought anything off of Timu ever again it would definitely be nails but these are what they look like they're just red with white hearts I just thought they were cute thought they were pretty you know nothing spectacular there but for under a buck heck yeah those are great and you don't have to wear hearts just for Valentine's Day I mean you can wear them any time of the year that you want okay I think I've bought <laughs> these lashes before and I had a really hard time putting them on so I don't know about these they were $1.99. They're the it's a pair of they're called natural slender, but they come in this box. And they're like already like pre-glued per se, but I had I could not get them on. I I just couldn't. Okay, hard to open the box too, but this is what they look like. Um there there's like a line of glue already on them. I don't know. I just had a really really hard time 
trying to get them on. I don't, I don't know. Maybe they just take some practice. They're really pretty, but I don't know. I'll try them again just to see, but I might need to like see how people are doing these because I could not, I could not get it figured out. So they were $1.99. I'm just probably just going to stick to my lash segments and that's that. <laughs> Okay, another floral. These are really pretty. They're like little roses. Um, they were three eighty four. Uh, color pink. Guys, I know I bought a ton of floral from Timu over time. I, I believe me when I say I use it too. Okay, this is like a. These are very very long stems. Let's kind of figure out what they look like when they're pulled apart. That's the best thing to do. When you get it, you're not obviously supposed to use it like this. You need to kind of get in there and it looks like kind of like a vine. So I would guess this would stick like down in your planter and then you want it to kind of vine downward like, like so. You would definitely need a couple of these, I think, to do anything with because, you know, it looks pretty sparse, but they look really great. I mean, the greenery looks good. Um, the, the roses look really nice. Very pretty. Very pretty, but I feel like you probably need, you know, like two or three of these to uh, make anything work for you. You know what I mean? Which that's, I mean, very rarely do you ever buy one floral stem and you're able to use it like that. But yeah, they're really pretty. I love the little roses on there. They're just really pretty. They look really nice. And I like that the greenery doesn't look fake. It's not like that fake green color. So I really like those. 384 for those. Okay, I've got a hat. I used to wear hats like all the time. I still like wearing hats. If you have like a weird hair day or something, this is the way to go. I like to wear them over wigs too. So this was 381 and the color is beige. I've had I bought several of these. I love this like style of hat. Um it's, they're great for summer too because they're really light. But it's kind of like a page, I don't know if it's like a page boy, I don't know what you call that, but it's got like a little emblem type thing right there. It's adjustable in the back, but really a great style hat. I really like them. So yeah, I bought several of these, 381 for those. And then, okay, I bought several of these too. The eye, <laughs> I always like to use these in my eyebrows. You get one for 44 cents. You know what these are, the little... Tinkle razors or whatever they call them. Although their their brand is T H T H K I E T -K T -K -E -K -E. I don't know. Kind of like Tinkle, but not. So forty four cents for that. That's a bargain. And then I have these. I have this extension ponytail. And oh my gosh, I don't know if this is gonna work or not, you guys. It's an extension ponytail. It's in the color M twelve six thirteen. It was five bucks. Um, these would be good to wear under the hat, like put your natural hair in a ponytail and then put this on and then, you know, do your thing with your hat. Sorry, the cat's over there in a bunch of boxes, but honestly, so here's, here's how you put it on. It's like all these hair extensions and it's on like a stretchy band, but the hair looks great. I would probably layer this because it seems to be like one layer. I would layer it, throw some dry shampoo in it throw some hairspray in it, but honestly, that looks really good. It, it, I mean, that looks really good. Put a, put a ball cap on, braid it, put this under a ball cap. Nobody would ever know. You could probably put it into a bun, but yeah, it needs some layering. And anytime you buy a hair piece like this, it's very, very like glossy. Sometimes you're better off washing these. There's usually like a film on them that makes them this sleek. And, and honestly, it's hard to... It's hard to work with any hair piece that's this sleek because it just won't stay. You can, sometimes you can't even get a bobby pin to stay in it. So use a lot of dry shampoo, use some uh, hairspray, get it dirty, wash it, and then it'll it'll get the consistency that you want. So yeah, that, that's going to be a cute little ponytail there. $4.49 for that. So we might mess around with that on a, on a Timu hair video sometime. Okay, I, these are more um, papers for journaling. They were two fifty four. You get twenty four sheets, and they are called. There's no real name to them. It just says twenty four sheets. That's all it says. The cat's down there eating all of my wrappers. But yeah, they're just like different sheets of paper, um, with different 
I don't know what you call like design, not really designs, but you know, textures, I guess is the word I'm looking for. Different textures on them. Really cool looking papers. I like that one. So yeah, you just get 24 pieces. Of, it's just a bunch of different textures. Um, they look kind of antique or older. Like here's like a antique page. So yeah, those are really nice. Kermie, don't eat my bags. Oh boy, I hope you didn't eat a piece of that. So yeah, $2.54 for those. And let me get those put away. All right. Let's see here. Oh, another pair of earrings. These are really going to be cute for summer. $3.59 for these. And they have these in different colors as well. Oops, the back just fell out. Dang it. This is what these look like. They're just beaded earrings. with. I love when gold is with... And I'm not a big gold wearer. Like, gold is not my favorite. But whenever you pair gold with, like, pink and orange, I love it. Like, how pretty are those? So pretty. So yeah, $3.59 for those. And they did have them in different colors. So I might go back and get some other colors if I haven't already. Okay, this is $1.69. It's more like junk journal papers. It's called Retro Vintage Materials. There's 30 pieces. And this has like a bee, a bumblebee type of uh, motif, I guess. Or I guess that's what you might want to call it. So this is the cover. This is the cover of it. You could actually use this piece in your junk journal. And then it has all these different kinds of bee paper. You get some of the same and some are different. Just all different kinds of papers. If you need junk journaling papers, I'm telling you, Timo is like the place. But I love anything with bees on it, so I love this kind of stuff. I could like just sit here and look through it all day long. Love it. These are great to like Mod Podge on the side. If you have like a a mason jar or something, you could Mod Podge these on, on it. And you know, if you maybe have like bees in your kitchen or something, you could like make your own decorations. So that would be cool. But yeah, I thought these were great. And they were only $1.69. And yeah, so you get all these pieces for $1.69, 30 pieces. That's not bad, not a bad deal. Okay. I, oh, here's another pair of <laughs> nails. Sorry, the cat's down here. I just want to make sure he's not eating anything. These were $6.99. That's a little bit on the high side for me as far as nails. But these were pretty cute. These are the, but these are also the handmade nails. So they are different, you know? I mean, they're just better quality overall uh, than the other nails. So let me see if I can get this open. So here's a better look at them. Aren't they pretty? They're like a cat eye. I always get mine in a medium. Large is too big for me. I tried the largest thinking, but oh, they're so cute. But again, you don't have to wear these for Valentine's. I absolutely love these. I think they're really cute. $6.99 for those. Okay, here is a bracelet. I bought this before and it was $2.48. I'm probably going to put this in a bin for a giveaway because the, my wrists are just, they're kind of like big and... This bracelet, it's it's a cute cuff bracelet, but I just feel like someone with smaller wrists, it would look so much better on. So I don't know. But yeah, $248 for those. I always have trouble with bracelets. It's just my just how it is. That's just how my I'm built. <laughs> so $248 for that. And the last, but certainly not least, I think. Yeah. I got a collar for Delilah. Um, it is a cute little pink breakaway collar with rhinestones on it. It was $2.69. I'll probably put this on her when I go upstairs. It is stinking adorable. I hope it fits her. I might have to tighten it up quite a bit. She's still pretty tiny, but hold on. Let me, well, this is what it looks like. <laughs> it's super bougie, pink, got a little bell on it. And, uh, yeah, that's what it looks like. Yeah, but it definitely is going to need um, tightened up because she is still really, really, really tiny. So hopefully I can get it tightened up and it'll look right because, yeah. But it's super cute. It's hard to figure out. Like, I can feel the only thing I don't like about this is I can feel the rhinestones are, like, sticky. And I'm afraid that'll stick to her fur. You know what I mean? And I don't want, I don't want her to hate it. 
but I don't want to pull her fur off either. You know what I mean? So I don't know. I'm not sure, but it is a breakaway collar. So I don't know. We'll, we'll see it. It kind of smells like glue too, which maybe I'll let it sit out. Maybe it'll dry because it was in that package, but it's really pretty. So, all right, everybody, that was my haul. Again, that was $2.69. So that was everything for this time. I hope you enjoyed this haul and thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.